here uh, in Jelengwa, Jelengwa Community Day Secondary School. What we're doing here is we are constructing a girls' hostel to respond to the growing needs of letting girls access a high quality education. Jelengwa Community Day Secondary School has seven feeder primary schools and of which some of the distances where these kids come from is 16 kilometers. Nakasale as one example of, of such a place. Uh, this solar system is, uh, is a centralized solar system, uh, which means it will have one uh, central generation point and from there the power is going to, to be distributed uh, to all the buildings on this campus. Uh, that is in the classrooms, to the uh, head teacher's office, the staff room, the, um, uh, the, li uh, the laboratory and the library, and it will also cover the, the hostel, the two hostels that are here. At the same time, it's, it's also going to be supplying power to the teacher's houses. So we are here at Njelengwa Community Day Secondary School to officially hand over the structure that have been the structures we've been working on for the past year. I'm so excited to be here this uh, day as we have been looking forward to this day, um, bringing light to Chitipa, transforming the lives of young people through the next, uh, transforming the lives of the communities through the next generation. We are here to witness that by donating the girls' hostel and also, not only that, the solar system and the water, uh, the, the boho that is uh, solar powered. You see, um, we, we thought that when we do this, when we donate a hostel to the girls, we are contributing to the education uh, advancement of uh, making every girl access education. I am Herring Zurungu, head teacher of Unjerengo Community Day Secondary School. Uh, to the part of girls, uh, they have been facing a lot of challenges, especially when looking at the distance they walk almost every day. It's a long distance. Some come even as far as 10 kilometers, of which for a girl child to move such a long distance is not uh, at a safe position. And many girls have dropped out of school because of that. And since the hostel has been introduced and has been given to us, it is our hope that every girl will remain at school and they will be boarding here, safe boarding, and in that way, dropout rate will be reduced. I'm Howard Kayange, the coordinating primary education advisor for Chitipa District. Jerengwa Secondary School is surrounded by about nine primary schools, which are feeder schools to this secondary school. The nearest is in Jerengwa Primary School, but other primary schools are far away. Learners used to commute more than five kilometers to the school. So with the coming, the construction of, the donation of the, the girls' hostel, it will alleviate accommodation um, learners have been facing, specifically girls. I'm very excited on behalf of uh, the community here and uh, all the people around this place. I'm a very happy to the authority because uh, it's an education department and uh, it also um, alleviates issues of school girls and gender uh, 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 based on admissions, yes. Okay. My name is Isaac Mumbani Nkambule. I'm the acting director of the administration for Chitipa District Council. 
Uh, as Tipa District Council, we are indeed excited and very happy to have received this donation from Tish, uh, our colleague, uh, Chesh in the USA. They have partnered with us and they have constructed a 64 bed hostel. It's something that we liked in this area and particularly targeting girls. Girls require better place to live, better place to sleep. So with the coming of the hostel, it has excited us and we are very happy. My name is Evan Kisi. I'm learning from this school, Jerengo Community Day Secondary School. We we receive this hostel. We want we are going to benefit in this hostel. Like we are going to sleep in good beds. We are going to to read different things because we have electricity. So today we celebrate what we've done together and we hope for what will happen in the future. So lelo tu gondwela pa zo mwe takala tabanga limozi komaso zo mwe ziza jitike nsogoro. And we also celebrate the fact that now people in Tanzania can be envious of the power at Jalangwa. Komaso tu gondwela kuti andu wapatija pa Tanzania akoza kumasi lila gona magesamene alipa njelengwa. Uh, down. Yeah. <laughs> so, to close, I want to thank the Page Tree Church for all the donation to this institution and uh, to the help you are giving to Chitipa as a whole. We hope that we can take this forward and uh, help a lot of communities as we journey on this. Brings a fire, ignites a candle, and makes his own. Carry your candle, and run to the darkness, seek out the helpless, confused and torn, and hold out your candle for all to see it. Take your candle and go like your word. Take your candle.